hopefully I am in frame. I'm pretty sure I am, but I'm not too sure. Hi guys, it's Gianna here and welcome back to another vlog. I just thought I'd do more of a sit down, chit chat kind of talk video with you guys because I haven't done a video like this on my vlog channel in the longest time and I just wanted to update you guys and just talk with you all and everything like that. So, it's currently 6.04 in the evening and it's Monday the 16th of July. I'm currently doing some painting and yes, before you guys comment, I know I am not an artist. I'm a really bad painter. I'm just doing this because it's really relaxing, mentally relaxing and not gonna lie, your girl's kind of in a bit of a sad mood. So I just thought I'd talk to you guys just on here about like mental health and talk to you about my day and just what I've been up to. And everything like that just kind of a chit chat video and just talk about some things that have been on my mind because you guys mean a lot to me and I love you all very much so I currently miss a certain someone and this is something that I've kind of not been avoiding telling YouTube about but I am dating someone and I've been together with this someone for a while now and he's currently just away and I'm missing him so if you see this, please come home, I miss you. But yeah, anyways, that's not really why I'm sad. I'm just kind of like in a bit of an upset mood because I'm, I just kind of feel like I try so hard for people or I put in so much effort for a lot of people. And I just, I just kind of feel like that it's unappreciated. Do you guys ever get into those moods and things like that? Because, you know, I just kind of feel like that now. And I've recently opened up on my channel about me having anxiety and it's just I don't really feel anxious I just kind of feel like upset and I've kind of got the blues but otherwise I'm happy you know it's just kind of a little bit I just I don't know how to explain it I just kind of feel like I always put in so much effort for a lot of people because I've been through a lot and I don't want anyone to ever feel like they're empty or don't want anyone to feel like they're ever left out and stuff so I give so much of my energy and I used to get so burnt out from it but I'm going to counseling and stuff helped me kind of recognize like, having a balance between keeping myself healthy and happy and keeping other people happy so it's good that I've gone to the counselor because she helped me Sue my counselor helped me to maintain that balance which I'm really really happy about but yeah I just kind of I don't know, I just feel like them trying a lot, uh, trying hard for people, but they're not really appreciating it. Or that people say that they miss me and that they want me around, but they don't act like they do. And actions speak louder than words, and this is just something that I've kind of recognized. But other than that, I do have a lot of amazing people in my life who I appreciate so much. And today, I met up with one of my friends who I hadn't seen in the longest time. And she is so genuine and so sweet, and it was really good seeing her, and I got such good energy. And I generally got such good energy from her, and it was really good seeing her. We both go to the same school, but we just don't hang around or hang in school because we both are in different classes, and um, she has a different friend group, and I have a different friend group, so... It was really good seeing her. I had such an amazing day and I'm excited for tomorrow because I'm meeting up with one of my good friends, Liam, and I'm possibly going to the gym tomorrow morning. So that's going to be really exciting because going to the gym kind of just, it's, it's fun for me. Like it's kind of relaxing and it takes my mind off things. So yeah, definitely that's something that I'm excited for. Also on Friday I'm catching a flight to Samoa so I have to pre-film a lot of videos and edit, edit them and get them uploaded before I go. So I'm hoping that I can get that done and that's why I just wanted to also film this vlog because you know I have to post on my vlog channel and I haven't in a while and I also just wanted to talk to you guys. So yeah, I have to film some videos before I go to Samoa. I've recently uploaded my haul video and my anxiety slash advice with Gianna video. So I'm going to probably do another video soon. I just don't know what to do. Oh, I might do just like a makeup routine. I know I did one of those a while ago, but my makeup has kind of changed. And I have like eyeshadow now and, <laughs> and stuff like that. So I want to do a video on that. So that will probably be up. So I'm probably going to film that tomorrow morning before I go see Liam. So I'm excited for that. I really want to help people in this world. That's something I want to go to, go on to when I'm older. I really want to help people. And so I really, really hope I can help someone by talking about mental health and talking about anxiety and stuff like that. Because, you know, 
I love helping people and I really want to help anyone who's struggling with just self-confidence or just struggling with stress and you know just feeling panic most of the time so yeah also some um, common symptoms of like anxiety or some common stereotypes of anxiety I have personally I have experienced but I haven't experienced all of them so in a video where I talk about my anxiety I just wanted to talk about how I knew I had anxiety and just how I've kind of dealt with it and how you know counseling has kind of helped me so if you guys want me to do that let me know down below as I said I'm not a healthcare professional so I'm just trying to you know make someone I'm trying to help people but again I'm not a healthcare professional so if you guys want me to do that let me know down below my hoop earrings I don't know if you guys noticed them in the first place but I got these hoop earrings from a jewelry stop jewelry stop jewelry shop called La Visa and they're actually really really nice so I wore these today and I wear these often and so I want to take off my makeup I'm, I'll probably do a nighttime skincare routine somewhere in the near future so if you want guys want that let me know down below but I use these simple kind of skin cleansing face facial wipes to take off my makeup and I don't really put on a lot of makeup so I just only use one it's mainly just my eyeshadow that I need to take off because I do not want to sleep with my eyeshadow on that would not be good so I'm just taking off my concealer I always conceal around my nose bridge kind of area because that's where it gets red a lot and I also conceal any blemishes and things like that so Yeah, oh my gosh. <laughs> there's like, there's paint on my hands. This is a struggle of being a left hand. I am left handed and sometimes paint just ends up on my fingers because I'm not an artist and I will never be an artist. Well, just it just takes practice. But I enjoy painting. I'm just better at other things. Painting's not my forte, but there are people out there who can paint really well, which is really amazing. And I'm, you know, stoked and stoked for them because painting is a talent and honestly one day I just want to be a really good painter but I know that if I keep on practicing and I keep on doing what I'm doing I'm sure that I'll get to that painting stage but for now I'm just doing it to enjoy and to kind of relax myself and to just get rid of get rid of any stress that I'm kind of just just feeling you know what I mean Anyway, so that is the end of this kind of sit down talking vlog. I hope you all enjoyed it. I just mainly wanted to communicate with you guys and talk to you all while I, while I painted my really bad attempt at a sunflower. But anyways, I love you all so much. Have a very amazing day, morning, evening or afternoon wherever you are in the world. I got paint on my fingers. See guys, I'm just not, I'm just not a painter. I'm really bad at painting. But in all honesty, it's really fun. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. As I said before, if you guys have any tips or tricks on how to do art, let me know down below. Or if you guys just have any questions you want to ask me, let me know down below. Anyways, I love you guys so much. Have a very amazing day, morning, evening, or afternoon, wherever you are in the world. And I'll see you on my next video.